And so we thought as a group to try to put a positive spin on this at the end. And LCRA has a large amount of acreage around the power plant here. Um, there's a, a lake there. Uh, it had all gone pretty much back to nature. And we thought for our community, a uh, park would be a good idea. And I had uh, made a friend with the group, uh, Mary Rice, who's passed away now. She was a bird watcher. We found out we shared that interest together. And we said, let's go to LCRA and talk them into giving us some land out there and let's make a trail. And um, they humored us. She, she was 86 at the time. I was in my late 30s, I guess, now 20 years ago. And uh, so we were like the classic example of what can come out of this because she was very much a Republican. I was very much a Democrat, but we really liked bird watching and that made us the best of friends. And our proposal went through with LCRA. They first gave us 18 acres, then we talked them into about 36. We literally, the two of us, went in with clippers and hacked the first trail through. Uh, but it was kind of that, you know, if you build it, it will come. The county recognized it. We dedicated it on Earth Day. Um, LCRA has since taken it on as it's, um, it was the first and they've used this example in several other areas. Now they have a very large uh, park system throughout their whole uh, river trail. I think they call it the Colorado River Trail. And there's a map to guide you to the different uh, parks along the uh, Colorado River.